So we're gonna talk about some special mobility considerations when it comes to patients in spinal precautions. Remember, they can't bend, twist, or turn, so we have to be so careful when we're moving them. Now, if they are also in C-spine precautions, make sure you have someone holding C-spine. Check out our lesson on positioning and fundamentals. We talk about reverse Trendelenburg. This is actually a great position for spinal precautions because it gets their head up without bending them at the waist. So let's say you need to roll this patient who's in spinal precautions, maybe just to wash their back or change their sheets. You need to lay them back flat and raise the bed to a working height, and you'll need three staff members, two to turn and one to do the patient care. The first staff member stands closest to the head, places one hand on the opposite shoulder and one hand on the patient's lower hip. Then the other staff member put, places one hand on the patient's upper hip and one hand behind the patient's knee. You're gonna notice these staff members cross their arms over, that's to help keep everything straight. Have the, staff, uh, the patient cross their arms if they can, and then the person closest to the head is gonna to count to three, and they're gonna to turn together. Again, making sure we don't bend or twist the patient's back. The third staff member can wash the patient's back, and when it's time to roll back again, count to three and roll back gently together. Again, the whole goal here is to not twist the patient. Of course, if you need to, switch sides and repeat it on the other side. Now again, if the patient is in C-spine precautions as well, you'll have some, someone holding the neck and that person is in charge of counting. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful. Remember, don't twist or turn or bend that patient. Be gentle. Now go out and be your best selves today, guys. And as always, happy nursing. Thanks for watching another nursing.com lesson. Click the link below in the description to watch thousands more lessons over on nursing.com. Also, be sure to hit the subscribe and the little bell to make sure you're reminded when new lessons come out. And if you wanna just keep watching more lessons, go ahead and click this video over here to continue learning. Like we always say here at nursing.com, happy nursing.